We are now learning new details about a young mother found shot to death behind a church south of San Antonio. Tonight, friends in Atascosa County are asking for your help tracking down the killer. Reporter Robert Price has more as loved ones search for answers in this troubling case. She didn't deserve this. Such a tragedy. Prayers for her baby girl. Friends and former classmates of Lindsay Watkins flood Facebook with memories of the Pleasanton High School grad. Her aura, her spirit, her laughter. The 29-year-old is now gone. Child without a mother now and uh, family lost their daughter. Henry Park lives down the street from the Watkins family. He'd see Lindsay most days pushing her young daughter in a stroller. They walk around the block every day. This is a quiet neighborhood and nobody's going to bother you, so that's where they get their exercise. But late Wednesday night, less than six miles from her family home, Watkins was found shot to death in a field behind Cowboy Fellowship Church. It's always been very quiet. Very quiet and peaceful. Well, it's tragic. You know, it's, so many things happen nowadays that uh, you just can't believe. The discovery disturbed neighbors and left friends of the young mother at a loss. Family members of Lindsay Watkins were too emotional to speak on camera, but I did have the chance to talk to her grandmother and aunt. They say Lindsay's mother had been looking for her daughter since Wednesday, the same day her body was found here in this field. But she didn't learn about the discovery until the next day. Nearly 48 hours later, the Atascosa County Sheriff's Office remains tight-lipped about the investigation. If they have leads, they aren't sane. We want to find out what happened. We want to know the true story and what happened. We want whoever's guilty punished. Those we spoke to say they have confidence law enforcement will get the job done. I don't think anybody's going to get away with this. I think they'll be caught. In Atascosa County, Robert Price, Fox News at 9. Well, the Atascosa County Sheriff's Office says it will release more details once Watkins' autopsy is complete.